is it that time again? Yes, it is. It's a plan with me time. And on the bottom of this week's um, layout in the happy planner, it said strive for progress, not perfection. And I'm like, that's totally what's going on in my life right now. That's a good job, Mambi. And these are some stickers that I had left over from when I used this kit once. And I ended up using none of them. I thought I wanted to use them, but no, apparently I didn't. And I also had these cat stickers that I got from AliExpress. And they're funny and cute and weird sometimes. And, you know, it's just a bunch of cats and they're like owner girl. And uh, they just do a bunch of crazy things. As, um, you can see as I'm kind of glancing through them here. And aside from the kitties and the sushi stickers that I did not use, I had a really hard time finding some washi for inspiration for a color palette. I finally ended up using an Argyle one that I got from AliExpress also, and I thought I was going to use those two on the side, but I didn't, so you can ignore those two. And the Argyle one, when I put it, some scrap on a piece of paper, the colors look like that. So I tried my best to get some coordinating colors for some supplemental stickers that I made myself, just some headers and checklists and date covers and a ton of half and quarter boxes, and I thought that would kind of fill things out a bit. And for some reason I forgot that you can take these pages out, so I'm just doing it in the binding and putting down some date covers, but it would not go straight, oh my gosh, there we go. And Wednesday I had a little bit of black bar peeking out, so I put it to the edge, and then I had to move Tuesday to the middle, and it was all a thing. I should have put some black in between those date covers, that would have been nice. And 31 did not get the color I wanted, so I colored it in black, because I could. And that's my thankful thought for the week. I don't know why I didn't type that when I was making that sticker. That could have saved me some awful handwriting there. Oh. And some of that Argyle washi tape. And trackers. Trackers a million. Just alternating trackers with tape. Some of those trackers, the ones with little banners on them, those are from the sushi kit. So, I lied, I did actually use some. And the other ones with the round corners are just like my default. Uh, random color tracker thingies so that I have something when a kit does not provide one to me. I'm finding that neutral colors are awesome because, surprise surprise, they go with everything. So even if I have a kit that's like, you know, blue and purple and whatever, if I just make like a light gray or uh, kind of a brown earthy color tracker, then I can get by, like it's okay. It's no pain on the eyes. Writing down my tracker things. Most of these are supposed to happen every day, and they do not, but oh well. Using my Kina print icon stickers to add a little cutiness to those trackers. And then, I thought I would use a different approach this week. Instead of writing down everything that was on my mind in the sidebar, I'd write them down per topic at the bottom. Because I find if I only plan chronologically, I have no idea if I'm like making my quota for the week on a particular project. So I thought, let's go ahead and write down all the things I need to get done this week for my art classes and all the things I need to get done this week for the drawing workshop that I'm teaching and everything that I need to clean for this week. And I don't know which days these are going to happen, but at least I will have this master list that I can just check them off once they're done. And I had to change my magenta cartridge so my fingers are kind of looking like they're bloodied or something, but they're not. They're just covered in a little bit of magenta ink. And also that um, date cover for the first, the corner got a little bit of a magenta ink fingerprint on it. Oops. Then put down some headers and I had to move the all about one but I accidentally scratched some of the ink so the first is looking really <laughs> um, disheveled I guess is a word to describe it. I really wanted to start reading too. Like when I was a kid, 
gosh, I read books like they were going out of style. Like I was always reading something. And somewhere along the line, that stopped. And I would like to get back into reading, but it's difficult when there aren't any books that capture my attention lately. Um, like even the, you know, super popular ones that were going around, like Game of Thrones and Hunger Games and all like that. Just not, uh, I don't know, I didn't, um, I didn't join the throngs of fans. So I thought I'd just start with reading The Earl's Treasure, which is a Regency novel that my mom actually wrote, and I haven't gotten to read it yet. Whoa, lighting change. Um, yeah, because I know I like her writing, so let's start off with something I know I'll like. On Monday, I, I think this was either Monday night or Tuesday morning, probably Monday night because it has the weird lighting. Um, and I had already known, or I had already known, I already did my things on Monday and so I just kind of copied that over from a little app that I had because I wanted to track if I was actually working enough during the day. It's kind of hard to know when you're working at home. Like, you'll get interrupted all the time by just, like, the doorbell, or the laundry's done, or whatever. And so sometimes I have a hard time figuring out if I actually worked as much as I'm supposed to work. So I thought I would keep track of the times, and yeah, that was the thing. On Tuesday, it's ironic that I put tick those boxes and I didn't use the check box list thingy. Because all I had to do was film, just like film all day, oh my gosh, just film all day. And I put a cat like falling off the table or something because that's how I felt about filming all day. And then I had to edit. And I tried to draw some scissors and it failed, so let's just cover that up. Nobody will know. And I just wrote down edit instead and survived the day because that would be good. I only needed half of the checklist, so I cut that one in half. And I had to make some templates for my art classes from the characters of Finding Dory. Another half box. Everything must be ready. Because like a genius, I decided to do not one, but two drawing events on June 1st. And so both of them had to have everything ready. So I had to do double the prep work. Yes, like I say, genius. So I used that cat with a bottle stuck on its head, both for my idiocy and because it looks like he's wearing a helmet. And I tried to make it see through, but it was too late. It was a mess. Oh well, I tried. Art classes. We're drawing Bailey from, or not drawing, sculpting. Sculpting Bailey from Finding Dory and doing some Samurai Jack, but that didn't happen. And please, can I just pass out after um, all this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday busyness? And then I'm like, oh, I better put down that work related workshop because I have to attend, but it's not on Sunday, it's on Saturday. So I had to move it over. And I thought I'd put down the weekend banner, but it was not looking good, so I put it down, down on the bottom. And there's this sticker of two cats ice skating, which I thought was both comical and adorable. So I put them down, and then put the workshop where it was supposed to be on Saturday. And also on Saturday, it's Paylone, so I put a little cry face. Actually, I should start using happy faces, because, you know, the more you pay off your loans, the closer you are to not being in debt. So this is a happy time, cat. Thursday, did some things, I had to help my mom with videos, and finished setting up my goal planner because the Recollections goal planner was not working out for me, and uh, there's a video all about that, how I made some stickers to try to get it to work for me. So yeah, that's a thing. And my diet begins, and there's a little Kina Prince sticker that says, feed me, I'm just so hungry all the time. Which isn't actually true, but it's hilarious, so <laughs> I like putting those whenever I have something diet related. For my workshop, do those things. Another half box. Wow, crooked much? And um, I gotta do lesson plans for July because it's a new topic, new medium, new everything, so I just gotta do everything. And then I accidentally wrote on top of that ice skating sticker and it smeared. So I had to fix it. More workshop stuff, more prepping for next week, and lots of video stuff. 
Sunday. Can I just rest, please? And I got a sleeping cat. And I just purposefully left that entire box blank. Like, can I just have a break? <laughs> That's what it felt like. So that was um, that. And I said, yeah, just rest. Because the only other thing I do on Sunday is clean. But since I already had everything to clean on the bottom, I felt like it would be redundant to write it again. So, although I did write everything else down again. Oh, well. Little notes to myself about things happening during the day. It was a weird class, I don't know. Didn't get to pass out. Man, I wanted to pass out so bad. I wanted to just sleep, please. Anyway, there it is.